All right, and hey there, Proxians, and this is Proxby here, and guys, welcome back to another episode of the Wind Waker HD Let's Play. So if you guys missed out during the last episode, we are now finally here at the Earth Temple, and what we are going to be doing here for today, guys, is that we're going to try and hopefully get ourselves with the Mirror Shield. Um, now, if we don't, uh, so if we don't actually get ourselves with the Mirror Shield, uh, not to worry, we will go and hold that off until the next episode, if that is going to be the case, but I'm pretty certain I think we will be picking up with the mirror shield anyways uh for here um but however if you guys recall uh during from the last episode uh we actually used medley to kind of glide ourselves over across here well now since medley's kind of in her own area right now since we already went and explored out with the shoes uh, within the one section here within the earth temple uh, we can actually go and use our deku leaf however and we can just be able to just fly on over here without any type of problems at all and uh, we don't have to go and really worry about with medley or anything of that nature right now because medley is going to be right in the same exact spot as how we actually left her at and that is very nice right there now just be careful with all the chews that are kind of being around here at the moment uh, we will just need to go and just head right through this door and this will kind of take us into I guess the hub section I guess uh, a little bit here for what uh, the earth temple kind of has to offer and uh, as you guys can probably tell there is like two different little sets here of the mirror shield section that we kind of have to go and do now unfortunately since we don't have the mirror shield we can't really go and be able to activate into going into the mirror puzzle section room just yet which that's a good thing because that I don't have to really go and have to really go and worry about that right now but however we do need to kind of go and use the help a medley here and medley is going to help us out on retrieving out on what this spot actually has to offer now this holds out on a skull hammer section and we just need to go and just basically use this to our advantage here go and just do a big old hit and that will now go open up that room for the time being you want to be careful of the purple fog that's going to be around in this place because if you're uh, not too careful enough it will actually stun you for a little bit and you won't be able to go and use any type of weapons or anything it's kind of like how uh with the purple bubbles that we are going to be seeing at some point they're going to be kind of doing the same as that type of thing and that's not going to be fun at all now if we go and start hanging on down from here though we can get to go and see that there is going to be some of these uh annoying bubbles the orange bubbles to be exact now not to worry about these guys here because we're going to make sure that we're going to use our sword or skull hammer to our advantage but that's all right <laughs> at least we were able to go in and at least do some sort of damage there for the time being now you want to be careful and kind of put medley in a, a little bit of a safe corner just in case because we are going to be meeting up with some brand new enemies known as the floor masters these guys are pretty annoyed they will go and pick up you or uh, pick up on medley and they will well basically bring medley back to where uh we well I, I guess if you kind of did lose out on medley she will go and show up back into like the first section that we were at from before and that's literally what's going to happen uh with those type of floor masters that are going to be there but now, uh, since we got that finally now opened up, let's now go and basically use Medley to our advantage again. And this is how we're going to be able to get ourselves now with the key. Now, there was a area within the hub section that we kind of needed a key for. And this is exactly on what we do need to go and do this here with. Now, once that opens up, I believe this is where the floor masters are going to literally appear. So you kind of want to make sure that you get out of here as fast as you can. Or else it's not going to be uh, a perfect uh, thing at all. So... Let's just go and put medley just right over here for right now and then we'll go and worry about tackling out with the enemies in just a little bit so let's go and pick this up get ourselves the small key so perfect and now yep here it is now we got ourselves these guys now be careful now you can actually go and throw bombs at them as well too but unfortunately they can go and uh, pick you up though however uh, they weren't gonna spot me out right away but yeah, that's literally what's going to happen. They'll pick you up and uh, literally take you back to where you last were. Now, Medley's literally right here, so I'm not going to really go and really bother about them right now at the moment. You can't go and use arrows on them uh, as well, too, uh, but it doesn't really do as much. Same with the bombs, but the, the sword will actually do quite a bit more damage, though. But there we go. So now we got ourselves that door finally opened. Uh, we'll get Medley back here in just in a little bit. I don't know where exactly Medley's at. Okay, she's over here. Let's just make sure that we go and grab her. All right, nice. Okay, so now we got ourselves Medley now. We got ourselves this door opened up from this side. 
And now we have to go and do a little bit of some puzzle movements around as well, too, here. Oh, God. Have to really watch out. Okay, so there's a whole bunch go. of shoes. I think this is how we're going to be able to kind of solve out on our problem here. So what we need to have is have both of these dark shoes. And uh, doing that, that will now go and lift down on this part here. That will kind of help us out with the stairs. Now we can just be able to just go and push this thing and push this all the way down to the side like that. And there we go. Now we finally got that section now finally back up and opened up. Now, I don't know if we do need medley uh, for this part. So we'll just have to just go in. No, I don't want to have to do that. All right, come on. Let's just get both these guys here. All right, thank you. Okay, so let's just go and pop you there. And then we'll just go and pick up this friend. And we'll just make sure that we go and also drop you there. All right. And I think we do need to bring Medley with us. So we'll just make sure that we'll just go and take her here to this little spot. Okay, perfect. Now we got ourselves this annoying problem. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Okay, wow, that was a close one right there. Whew. Thank God. All right, we were able to take care of that guy. Yeah, I thought for sure that floor master was going to probably grab me. But it seems like we're already okay. So if I push this crate on over to this way, we now finally got ourselves uh, another thing for uh, Medley's shield to kind of help us out a little bit. So let's go and put that to the test. And I think that should kind of help us out on moving up with the next block that's going to be here as well too. Okay, now there's quite a bit of other things that we can kind of go and do, and that's kind of like uh, blowing up with these different type of little sections. So now we got ourselves a, uh, a hidden pot that we can actually go and uh, return back to if we ever do need it. Uh, we also do have this section as well, too, in the process, which that will give us ourselves another block, which I think by now that should uh, kind of help us out on heading on over to the exact... Oh, come on. There we go. Perfect. Blow up on this guy here nice and I think with that block I think that will probably give ourselves a hidden chest if I push it over to this side here let me go and do that yep okay so it gives ourselves a hidden chest and then if I go and push with the other block then that will just kind of give ourselves a little bit of a nice good uh, little uh, jumping platform so that we can then just be able to head on over to the other part of this dungeon which and that will be great all right, and I think with that being said in mind, we now finally got this part finally here now. Nice. Okay, the door is now finally opened. And let's go and pick you up. Perfect. And let's just go and just send Medley right to the exact spot. Okay. And let's go and grab this and let's see what we got. And with that being said in mind, what do we get here? Is this going to be the compass? Yes, it is. All right, and we finally got ourselves the compass. Oh, and it seems like we got something else here. So, Prox, do not worry about straying away from Medley in the depths of the temple. Just relax and open up your dungeon map. Okay, so not to worry. So, thank you there, uh, King of Red Lions. So, now we're in this spot. Uh-oh, this seems a little bit scary. We got ourselves a whole bunch of moblin problem. All right, and not only that, but we do have ourselves our very first pose as well, too, in the process. Now, we just need to make sure that we get these guys out of here nice all right there we go so not too shabby there let's go and get medley and hopefully that can kind of help us out with these poe problem okay let's go before they attack us oh no go 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 move all right phew all right let's go and get these guys out of the way first oh come on you oh come on yeah these guys are always kind of annoyed to literally go and literally battle out there. Oh, there we go. We at least got one down. Okay, so let's go grab out on this Poe. Oh, well, thank you to Medley. We're able to go and destroy it on that. All right. Come on. There we go. All right, so that Poe's finished. And now it's just onwards to the next one. All right, here we go. Maybe if I'm lucky enough, maybe I can at least try to grab out the Poe that's going to be uh, trying to possess us. Oh, there we go. Hold on. And with that, nice. Now we can go and get this Poe out of the way. Sweet. All right. And I think that is perfect. Now we'll now go and we'll retrieve out uh, with the stairs that we do need. Ooh, and as, thank you for the skull necklace, though. 
And I think we got ourselves another extra chest as well, too, in the process. I think this may probably just be probably just a regular, maybe like Joy Pendant or something. Yeah, it's just a, a regular Joy Pendant. Nothing really too much out of the ordinary for that one. Okay. So that's fine. Uh, I do see that there is, seems like to be a special door down here. Now, if I do have the mirror shield, uh, this would be a perfect spot to come back here, too, because it seems like I can go and do something uh, with... Oh, no. Let's just get back down. Because we do need to come back to this part, and we'll just have to see if that will hold out on a uh, on a treasure chart or not. Okay, so there's a door up that way, so we have to go through this one here. Okay. So through this door that we go into... And, uh, oh goodness. Alright, so this is where we're going to be seeing the big battle of the Re-Deads. And, uh, we should at least go in and do this one at a time, at least. Because these Re-Deads are pretty annoying, if I do have to say so myself. Alright, there we go. So that Re-Dead is done. Oh no! Yeah. These guys are very, very, very creepy, if I do have to say so myself. Yeah, just make sure that you knock out on those Re-Deads as fast as possible. Oh, there's a key right here for us. Nice. So we got that taken care of, and I think the last one, we have to go and take care of one more re-dead. Not really all that too much of a problem there. We just keep on giving a nice few good whacks, and that re-dead is done. Nice. And also, too, it seems like these re-deads do go a lot faster than what they do regularly in the uh, in the normal GameCube version. Because in the GameCube version, they do take like a really long time for them to actually get themselves completely knocked out. But there we go. So that's now taken care of. Let's go through the other door that's here. Oh no. Oh no. I'm so sorry, Medley. Oh no. And now she's all confused. Don't worry. Hold on. Let's go and just open up the door first. And then we'll go and re-pick her back up. Or maybe what's going to happen here. Nope. So we're completely locked in. Oh no. Well, we got ourselves our very first big Stealthos. These guys can become a little bit scary. Oh no. Yeah. And they do give off a nice big huge hit. But if I am lucky enough... There we go. Just keep on knocking him around if we are lucky enough. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh no, he's recharging himself back up again. Now bombs do also work as well too. And you can kind of get yourself a little bit of a nice better uh, hit. Just kind of lead him onwards to there. There you go. And you don't have to even worry about using the sword at all. But there we go. This big Stealthos is literally already knocked out. Oh no. <laughs> now we got ourselves another Stealthos. Great. Even though that we just already knocked out with one, they got ourselves now with two more. Oh, this is not what I was wanting to expect out from here. Alright, so Bomb, just make sure that you kind of line up exactly as where this guy's going to be at. Alright, just kind of place it right there. Now, he may become really annoying, but there we go. We got him. We got him, we got him, we got him. Alright, there we go. So that stealth post is out of the way. Next one, just throw a bomb. And I think with that being said, if you kind of line it up perfectly, there he goes. Now we can just go and start knocking him around now at this point. Come on, come on, come on. Just repeatedly knock him down. Nice. And I think we are now golden. I don't know if they give us anything special, like any type of necklaces or anything. No. Okay, it doesn't really seem like they kind of go and do that. But anyways, if we go and open up with this special chest, which we already kind of know that if any type of purplish type of chest is around here, you know that we're going to get ourselves an upgrade. So we got ourselves now with the mirror shield. We can now finally be able to go and use that to our advantage. And we can be able to get ourselves on out of here as well in the process. So let's go ahead and do that. And with the power of our mirror shield, let's go and put that to the test. Just kind of shine it up exactly as where the uh, where the sun symbol is going to be. And there we are. And now we can now go finally talk back on over to Medley finally. And uh, kind of see what we can go and do with that other uh, little section from before. Oh, there's Medley right there. So before we go and worry about that, we got ourselves a, a battle with these moblins again. There we go. Get them out of here. Sweet. Alright, so not too shabby there. Come on. There we go. Get him done. And get this mob wood finished. Hey. Come here. There you go. Now he's finished. Now he's just going to literally worry about uh, these guys for a quick second. 
we'll just go and worry about these poses and we'll make sure that they get out and out of here. All right, let's go and put that to the test. Nice. And let's just go get his friend as well, too. Come on. There we go. Okay, now we got both pose. Oh, come on, you. There we go. And now... Ugh, there we go. Went and taking care of both of them. Now, let's go and finally bring Medley. And let's go and get this uh, little part all done. And I think this is where we do get ourselves a, uh, a treasure chart, I want to say, from this. If we are lucky enough. Because all we have to do is just go and do something. Or, well, I think we have to go and bring probably Medley up here first. So let's go and do that. Alright, so we'll try out Medley. And I think, if I am lucky enough, we should be able to get this right away. Alright, just go right on over to here. And then just kind of tilt it downwards, like I think right around there. Because that should hopefully be uh, hopefully somewhat better. And then just bring out your own type of thing and bust down this. And I think... With that being said, should reveal out a pathway for us here and take us to another little hidden room. Yeah, just right behind in this area as well too, but I can't really recall if there is anything special around in here. Huh, interesting. So I guess we can't really go and do too much. Maybe if I have to go and probably destroy one thing, it'll probably open up another type of sun path or something. Uh, maybe not. Okay, now this one may be a little bit difficult because we may probably need the help uh, with Medley here. So we should probably go and call her back wherever she went off to. Medley, where did you go? Okay, there she is. Yeah, because I think something tells me that I think we do need her for this part. Because if we go down from here, yeah, because I think we need to go and bust down this section. Okay, so with the power of Medley... Let's go and see what we can do with our shield. Okay, so there we go. So we got that part. And then just kind of hold it around right into that spot. And I think with our shield here, if I am lucky enough, get a... Eh, it's kind of hard to get a nice good... Uh, get a nice good beam. Oh, there we go. No, I didn't want to do that. Ugh. Dang it. Uh. Okay. I got one more in me, and then if I can't do it, then I'm going to probably have to end off this episode here. Come on. Okay. Just do it right. Maybe right there. Maybe just have to light it up perfectly. No. It's kind of hard. No. Okay. Fine. I guess I'll have to hold that off until the next time then. Because that part's just a little bit frustrating. But anyways, I'll see you guys in the next one. Uh, at least we got ourselves the mirror shield. But we'll just have to see what happens within the next episode. We could possibly run on into the boss at some point. But we'll see what happens. Uh, but I'll see you guys then. And of course, peace.